I'm Jules Ketcher. I'm a mixed media artist. I started late in life with my art. Through experience, I like to work in layers. I get my inspiration in nature. Nature is like life. It changes constantly. We have imperfections. We have impermanence. Things constantly change. It's the way we react to it that makes a difference. Tubes. They look like tree trunks. So I thought, wouldn't it be fun to make these in hanging off different trees in different areas? I gravitate to fall colors like orange. So I used three long screws that I had found at the ReStore and I'm repurposing them and put them in in different intervals. The next one will probably be a little different. I take an idea from one and then continue on the next one. But when you twine, you can do it really tight and you have indentations, or you can make it looser so it's straight. To me, the imperfections add something to the piece. None of us is perfect, and I like that element of imperfection. Nothing is for the eternity. Everything changes, and to me, that is the beauty of it all. Like a story, each, each um, twist adds to the story. It's just another layer, it's another way of expressing myself. The piece is called uh, In Flight, Destination Unknown. This piece is about uh, taking flight when I come into my studio, I put on my favorite wings and I fly. Feathers depict that. I love birds. They're free. They fly. They don't worry. Now we are here, then we are gone, just like that. It is the journey that counts. Take flight. Tell me your dreams. So in this, I, these are my dreams. These are my words incorporated into this. I like to mix soft with hard. The depiction of bare grass. I added metal to the softness of the fiber. I added my writing. I like to go to thrift stores. This is where I found these pieces. These are little weavings that I love doing. This one was inspired by the backwaters in Florida. We rented a little house in the Keys, in the Florida Keys, Summerlin Key, and this was my view, kind of. From anywhere in the house, you saw the ocean. At tide, it would change. So I tried to depict what I saw using my artistic license to put my feeling into it and um, this is what I came up with. These wrappings around here depict the waves as they come during the tide. Different color of the ocean. This is part of an eco printing process. This was, this printing was done with rust old pieces of rust that was wrapped up in this versus this is using leaves, things from nature. This is part of an eco printing process. I use leaves. Those are peony leaves and sumac leaves that were printed onto silk. I have been thinking lately to see what the elements in the winter would do to this piece of cloth. So I collected pieces of metal that are already rusted. Bundle up these pieces of metal, spread it out in the yard here, and see what happens. Now I'm gonna wrap it, make a bundle. And as I bundle it, I put more pieces on. Thing will change. And this is what I'm after. I'm excited to see what the elements will do to this. With frost, 
with snow, with rain, with sun. And I love it. It's very zenish to me. It's, it's meditative. And that's part of my work is as I do, I let my mind wander and travel to different places, places I've been, places I've not been, and it just adds a nice rhythm to the piece.